one of the questions I always get besides what's the difference between bison and buffalo is do you have to have a permit to raise bison? What does it take to raise bison? How to start a bison herd. Uh, there's no perfect way of doing this. I'll just tell you my experience and what I did. But there's several different things that I want to talk to you about today that will help you get started. Uh, there's no special permit. Uh, there's no special license or anything to raise bison. Uh, these are not exotic animals. Um, you know, you're not, you're not raising animals that are, are, are from a zoo. I know there's bison in some zoos, but this is not an exotic animal. Um, this is a natural species that uh, occurs here. And uh, basically, it's, it's kind of like cattle. Um, you, if, if you want to start raising cattle for whatever reason you want to start raising cattle for, you can do it. Uh, you don't have to have any special permit to raise bison. Um, you don't have to set a special license or anything like that. As long as you have really good facilities, um, obviously to uh, contain the bison, good fencing, um, and, and you kind of have a background in it, it would, it would definitely help. If you have somebody local or somebody in your state that you can contact and start from there, that, that's probably the easiest way to do it. And they'll kind of point you in the right direction. I'll do whatever I can to help. I would love to help. Um, you know, I'm here in Oklahoma and I can answer any questions that you have for me. That's not a problem. I got in contact with a guy and I was just really lucky because this guy happened to be a big time bison guy. He's 30 minutes down the road from our farm. And so I was just really lucky. And I got a hold of um, Doc Parsons and, and he pointed me in the right direction. Thank you.